I'm really excited to invite out Craig Federici to show you iPhone 10 and what it's like to use it for the very first time. Craig? Hey, hey everybody. Wow, well, I'm absolutely thrilled to be able to give all of you your first live look at iPhone 10. Uh, this is a phone we've been dreaming about for a long time, but the reality of it in your hand, it's, uh, it's really something epic. So let's take a look. Here is iPhone 10. Now, unlocking it is as easy as looking at it and swiping up. And, you know, let's try that again. Ho, ho, ho. Let's uh, go to back up here and get right in. So here we are, and you see this expansive display. It's just a beautiful canvas for all of your content and your gestures. And I'm just going to go into the weather app here, and you can just see how apps look when they take advantage of the edge-to-edge -edge display. Now, exiting an app couldn't be easier. You just swipe from the bottom, just like this, and throw the app right back on the home screen. Let me do that again. Swipe right up. Let's take a look at the web. It just looks unbelievable, edge-to-edge -edge on this display. And your photos, of course, are just gorgeous as well. Let's jump into this one. Just amazing. Now, video, of course, is unbelievable on the Super Retina display. It looks great in portrait and in landscape. And of course, this is HDR video. Just incredible looking. Now, Phil told you a little bit about multitasking on the device. Let me show you. I'm just going to jump into Maps. And if I want to move between my applications, I can just swipe up and stop. And my other apps all come in. I can get at them with a the tap. Just lift. It's just that easy. And we have a great shortcut as well. You can actually move back between apps just by swiping along the bottom like this. It's really easy. Now, you may be wondering about Control Center. And worry not. Right where your status indicators are in the upper right-hand corner, you can just swipe down and get it control center from anywhere. It's that easy. Now let's take a look again at Face ID, because unlocking your phone is just amazingly intuitive. You just raise it, look at it, and swipe right up to get started. But now, it's also incredibly fast, so I'm just going to do that again. I just raise it, look at it, swipe. I don't have to wait. And it's also really, really smart. So let's say I wake my phone, and I'm not looking at it. It stays locked. But once I give it my, once I give it my attention, well, it unlocks, and I can get right in. It's really cool. Now, Face ID is also great for Apple Pay. So if I'm at the register, I can just double click on the side button. I'm authenticated, and I can get in just like that. Now, the true depth camera behind Face ID isn't just about authentication. In fact, we've extended AR Kit with some incredible new face tracking capabilities that provide a whole new class of augmented reality experiences. Now, we've been working on one with Snapchat, and I'd like to show it to you now. So I'm going to launch in. You see it builds a mesh in my face, and now I can just select a mask. The tracking is just unreal. Let's check out this one. Now look at the detail over the eyes, the incredible metallic reflections, the quality of the tracking, it's, it's just stunning. Now, of course, many of us like to communicate with emoji. And with an emoji, we can now breathe our own personality into our favorites. It's available as an app right inside of Messages. So I can just go right in here, and it immediately starts tracking me. So I can make whatever expression I want, like, and just pick that up and use it as a sticker, drop it on my message like that. We also let you manipulate these in full screen. You can audition your favorites, and there's some really great ones, like the kitty cat, so expressive and ferocious. It's a happy puppy. Check out the physics in the ears, the pig. 
<laughs> We've got a chicken. And the unicorn, mythical creature, favorite of the startup. And yes. If you were by chance wondering what humanity would do when given access to the most advanced facial tracking technology available, you now have your answer. <laughs> now, these can be so much fun, you're going to want to share them. And fortunately, we let you record messages. I'm going to record a message here for Tim. Hey, uh, Tim, I'm not sure what the protocol is here, but I'd like to call dibs on the fox for my favorite emoji. Uh, which one do you like? Hey, uh, Tim, I'm not sure what the protocol is here, but I'd like to call dibs on the fox for my favorite emoji. Uh, which one do you like? Now, you can send it with ju just a tap, and it appears as a looping video right inside the transcript. If we're really lucky for our grand finale, we might just get a response back from Tim. <laughs> oh, here it is. Let's, uh, let's take a look. Take me to your leader. Wait a minute, Craig. I am your leader. Let's wrap this thing up. <laughs> so that is your first look at the new iPhone 10 and the amazing experience with the TrueDepth camera and Animoji. I think you're going to love it. Thank you very much.